if my calculations are correct, after this level, extravaganza, I will be at 26 exits. Which, so this would be 26 exits. There are 32 in total. So I would be missing, what, six? I am confused about how short this level is and what's going on. Why is it so short? <laughs> what's going on? Um, am I going to live? Not if I don't get through there. Oh, okay. So, this is very, very short, kind of scary level. I uh, did not make it up there. That's fine. Fish. Oh, fish. Fish, 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 fish. Almost. <laughs> okay. There we go. I don't know if I'm gonna make. Ugh. Okay. 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 Go, 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 go. Got another. I don't know if I need all the shine sprites. That's the big thing. I don't think I do because nothing has led me to believe so far that I need the shine sprites. But I am kind of thinking I might in the end. Cloudy Woods. That level. Nothing was really wrong with it. It was just a very, very fast level. Uh, the music, well, the 100 seconds or whatever, definitely was made to make you panic. Like, <laughs> that is a definite, um, the 100 seconds was made to make you panic, even though it gives you, theoretically, plenty of time to beat the level. Even though I had six seconds left, I mean, that's still more than enough especially for an auto scroller where you can't really dictate how fast you go um i'm also not i was gonna say i'm not skipping the level like i could have flown over this level but it was so short like i felt like i was missing something i might have there probably pipes i could have gone down kind of confused why that was so short um, again this one it doesn't look like it's gonna be a very long level like it kind of feels like it's gonna be a short level probably because I'm not like overly exploring but I also can't tell where safe is like when I go down. So I don't feel like I should be taking a lot of risks and uh, going down too far. Like I can go down here, like there's a shine sprite I could totally get. But again, the game has not really led me to believe shine sprites are that important. You gosh dang turtle. I want a feather again because now I feel naked. That's that's not that's not what I asked for, game. I like being able to float and feel like I can float. <laughs> <laughs> feel like uh I want a feather again please give me one you're not gonna you're not gonna whatever whatever it's a level nothing wrong with it I don't know those levels I mean extravaganza that one made sense because it was supposed to make you feel rushed. The other two are just fairly short levels. Like, I've I've talked about this before. It's like the end of game burnout. 
where especially, especially for single party developers, um, you, you get burned out at the end. Like, it's not that you rush to get it finished. It's darker lava is solid. You can walk on it safely. Also, you can use spin jump on the thumps. Yeah, I know. Um, but yeah, it, it's not, it's not that like people rush to get their stuff done and like rush to completion. It's purely like by the end you, you are actually burnt out on it. Like really, really burnt out on it. Uh, I don't like these tiny hops. But yeah, it's like at the end, your creativity is kind of not what it used to be. Okay. You know what? No, I'm not. I'm not gonna accept that. Yes, I couldn't tell what that was. Okay. Oh, well, at least they give you a springboard because they're like, oh yeah, you will probably screw this up. Can I? No, I don't think I can. Okay, just get through, just get through there. Again, level is not that long. Fairly, fairly short. Welcome, my name is Pitch Black. This island is boring, everyone is gone. Do you want to be my friend? I'll be your friend by throwing things at your face. Why would you do that? Like, the dude legit is just like, I wanna be your friend. I don't want, I don't want to hurt my friends. They just disappeared. Don't be afraid of me. Like, dude just wants to be your friend. Like, legit, really just wants to be your friend. And you're like, nah, I'm just gonna throw blocks at your big bulbous eye. That's, that's not very, that's not very nice of you, Mario. Like, not nice at all. Eternal Dawn. Well, we had Eternal Rain earlier. Eternal Dawn. The full moon island was known as the Ghost Island by its inhabitants before they disappeared. Okay. Okay. You should have been dead, Mr. Flame. You know... I think that's one one thing that people tend to not do super well on like custom stories. Like if you take the original Mario story of Peach has been kidnapped, go go save Peach because Bowser is evil. You know, that's super easy to work with. Like there there's not much like you could do that is inherently wrong with that. Like really, there's not much you can do that's inherently wrong with, hey, go go save the Mushroom Kingdom because Peach is good and Bowser bad. But when people do their own stories, like it's nothing is wrong with it, but like little details seem to be left out from time to time and then added in later. And it's like, does that really matter? Kind of like the, oh, Full Moon Island used to be called Ghost Island by the inhabitants before they disappeared. Why, why you do that to me? Um, But yeah, it's like, is that really frick? I was doing such a good job at keeping that around. Oh, it's right there. Ah, uh, whatever. A legend says that every 20 years, a black portal leads unaware people to the ghost island. No one ever come, came back. I have zero clue. Zero clue where to actually use that piece. Which also, I realized just now I should have dropped my fire flower down and didn't. I should have done that. Should have. Didn't. Should have. Uh, 
Oh well. My my bad. 